last chance. Um, we have 34 horses in the rescue, including a cow and a pig. Um, they've come in from all different walks of life, um, being um, injured at the track, having um, being starving to, you know, one couple were dropped off from the slaughterhouses, like stuff like that. But they're all here now and we turn them into therapeutic animals to work within the community. Yeah. So what they do is we take our miniatures um, to the hospitals and they go every summer and to all the nursing homes too. We are about 500, four to 500 for grain depending on what we have to get. Mm -hmm. And uh, shavings right now until they, once they go out, once the paddocks dry up enough, they're out 24 seven. Stonky, he's in his late 40s. Oh, wow. This is buckwheat. And he drills like an old man. <laughs> he looks like Tina. He needs, uh, he needs to get to the salon. <laughs> they called us because they don't have horses. They just take in donkeys. And so they called and said, could you take Penny? You know, we rescued her from a situation. They're all different. Donkeys are very sensible and very loving. Uh, Penny Berry and Thoroughbred mix. He's 40 years old. Floyd. 36 years old. He's one of our senior seniors. Yeah. Um, I found him starving in the field. He weighed 700 pounds. He goes a good weight now. I think between 12 and 1300, somewhere around there. And then Kelly. Kelly's oh. another one. Her owner died and then she had nowhere to go and she was in bad shape. Kelly came in and Kelly's um, Kelly's in her 30s too, 33, 34. She wants another treat. Yeah. So a guy is a great little therapy pony too. This is um, Chewy. Summer's really different for us. Yeah. Uh, we can't have any fundraising events. We can't have, we can't be open to the public right now. Um, we rely, we are a registered Canadian charity. Um, we're registered with the Canadian government. Uh, and uh, so this year is going to be a real hard year for us with the Corona-19 virus um, with getting funding because our funding comes from our, our fundraisers yep. and, and all of that. And without that, um, you know, we have, and general, we're, we're all donation and volunteer based. No one here gets paid for nothing. All the money goes into the grain, the hay, their feet, the vet all of that. We also have teens that come here and the teens might have um, different um, mental issues like depression, anxiety, um, you know one girl her mom had cancer and she was feeling lost and she came here and she connected with a horse called Chase and Chase is a, a wonderful animal. Um, they would donate through our website, which is lchpr.org, and uh, that you would go on there and find our website. There's a testimonial of the teens and a video that the teens made themselves, which is absolutely wonderful.